This was once a stony wasteland, but over the past 30 years, farmers in Burkina Faso have used simple techniques to beat back the desert so crops can thrive. In the small hamlet of Rim near the border with Mali, farmers used the zai or stone contour method to rehabilitate depleted soil. It was a question of using stones to make small barriers, which form a cordon slowing down the runoff water, letting it filter into the soil rather than running down the slope. This infiltration is what allows the plants to grow. These practices have transformed lives in the landlocked West African state, where 80% of people rely on farming. I have a family of 11 people. At the moment, my store is full of grain and I haven't touched it. I also have plenty of beans, and all this is thanks to the technique of stone barriers that we introduced. Up to 750,000 acres of barren land has been rehabilitated in this way, but in a region threatened by the advancing Sahara Desert, there is more to be done. There are still many families who have not had the chance to change. They know and they want to adopt these practices, but they need the means. It doesn't take a lot, but the resources need to be directed to those who need them to implement these practices. The success of sustainable farming is bringing food security to the impoverished former French colony, but it is also helping stop a rural exodus that is straining resources in urban centres. Instead of being lured by the city, a new generation of young villagers see their future on the land. Valdi Carosa, CCTV.